What does it mean to you to receive the BBVA Foundation Frontiers of Knowledge Award in the category of Economics, Finance, and Management? Oh, it's just a wonderful honor, and I'm absolutely delighted. Um, and the ability to be able to join um, some of the wonderful other scholars who've um, won this award in previous years, not only economists, but non-economists. It's a really great honor, and I'm absolutely delighted. The jury has highlighted that within your career, there are many contributions in many different areas, from the consumption theory to the measurement of the poorish. How have you established your research areas, and what has made you decide to move from one area to the other? Well, not very conscious, I'm afraid. It's just more or less accidental. So one of the great joys about being an academic is that um, you can work on one thing and then it turns into something else and it opens up interesting areas in some completely different field. So I've had the great good fortune to work on many different things. And it's really wonderful that the foundation has mentioned so many of them um, in their honorary statement. I think that's just terrific. You have incorporated a subjective element, individual in economy. How may you use this element, for instance, to activate consumption in a period of crisis? Um, this refers to some of the more recent work I've been doing. Um, one of the great pleasures of being here at Princeton in the center where we are now is that we um, sit here with psychologists and sociologists and other people. And I had the great good fortune to um, work with um, Danny Kahneman um, for several years. And he got me interested in measuring well-being by just asking people how they perceive their own well-being. I think that's an enormously interesting um, set of questions, some of them very difficult, and we're trying to see whether this is a supplement or a replacement or what difference it makes to the way that we've usually measured well-being um, as economists. So it's a very exciting area, and I'm not at all sure where it's going to lead in the end, but it's important and it's interesting and it's a lot of fun. In which research area are you working on right now? Well, I'm working on subjective well-being, which I've talked about a little bit. Um, I'm also working on the measurement of prices around the world and how you measure well-being in a more traditional economic way in different countries um, around the globe. Um, I'm also interested in a whole set of health issues. One of the things when you get as old as I am and you've worked in economics for as long as I have, is that you discover that nothing that um, you ever start on ever completely goes away. So I'm still working on a lot of different things and I hope that will go on for many years.